Okay, so let's try to look at what a vector is. It has both some quantity measurement and it has a direction measurement. Uh, how it's normally stated, it has both a scalar portion, uh, sorry, my bad. It has a magnitude and a direction. Okay, so a vector is a quantity with both magnitude and direction. And again, that's a very technical term. Let's just try to simplify it a lot easier. If we were to just describe this, it looks like a line with a direction. So a much more simpler way of thinking about it is a directed line segment. So it's a line with a direction to it. So now we can go back and try to look at this magnitude. A much easier way to say magnitude will be to consider the length of the vector itself. So whenever you see the word magnitude, it sounds very technical, but it just really represents the length of the vector. So the length. So that would be how long the vector is, and the arrow tells you in what direction it's pointing. So that's nice. We can now describe the cheetah in terms of a position vector. But we're going to see that there's a big problem with position vectors because if you notice at the very beginning, I said we can place our origin anywhere along the tree. So what's to stop somebody else placing the origin on top of the tree? They will both measure different values. So they're going to disagree on where the cheetah is. So we're going to solve this in the next video.